all right you guys so if you are regular to my channel you know what time it is it's time to clock in and today i will be giving y'all a full body banded workout basically a full body workout using resistance bands so like i always say either you're gonna grab you some popcorn and watch or you finna grab you some resistance bands and clock in and all these workouts if you don't have resistance bands you could do it without so without further ado let's get started and happy hump day So for this next one, I'm going to be grabbing a thicker band and doing some inner thigh pulses. So I'm going to be putting the band high up on my thighs. I'm going to be taking my legs straight out, pulsing up as they're wide, and then bringing them back in. Okay, so the next one I'm going to be doing is some squatted back pulse abductions. I guess I just kind of came up with a name. So this is how it looks. You go into the squat position, hold your hands above your head, and you pulse it out. some tabletop plank side taps. So this is how this looks. Same thing, you're gonna take the band, put it around your ankle. And the tabletop plank is basically like when you're on your toes with your knees are tucked in. So I'm gonna do 12 taps to the side. So the next thing I'm going to do is a fire hydrant into a donkey kick and I'm going to do one leg at a time and I'm going to be using this thick band. I'm going to do 16 on each leg. So remember you can always do these without the band.
So for this last one, I'm gonna be doing sit-ups, but I'm gonna have my hands banded together like this, which will allow me to not use so much force to bring myself up with my hands because they're in place. And I'm gonna do 12 of those. complete two more sets of that and then I'll be right back with my hip circuit to finish off my workout. Okay so I have completed my three rounds with well, my two extra rounds including the one I just did and so now I'm going to get ready for my cardio burnout which I'm going to be performing each exercise for 30 seconds on 30 second break for three rounds all right so the first exercise is two jacks and two punches so I'd like to have some music playing and catch my rhythm and this is how it looks. There you going? y'all know that losing weight is not easy like it's a very tedious that takes a lot of consistency and dedication it's a task you know and it's something that you have to work towards every single day like a lot of people look at me and see my results and ask how did I get there and honestly I've tried several things but the most thing that works is eating right staying in the calorie deficient and staying consistent no matter what you do the number one key is staying consistent if you take it one step at a time, but stand consistent while taking it one step at a time, you will get the results that you want. And the only reason why I'm saying it is because a lot of people lose weight because they see stuff on Instagram. You know, they see people with, with these surgical bodies and bodies that's not realistic. And it's like when you're trying to do something realistic, a natural way, it's going to take time. It's going to take patience 
and it's going to take consistency to actually get the body that you want. It's so many days that I woke up and just cried and like, why do I want to do this? Why do I want to keep going? And I realized that if it's something that you really want to achieve and it's something that you really put your mind to, and nothing can stop you, you guys. Like, literally nothing has stopped me. It has been plenty of times that I have cried and I talked about it like, dang, or maybe I'm losing too much weight or maybe I'm working myself too hard. But you have to work, hard, work smarter, not harder. And... When I say work smarter, not harder, basically, don't kill yourself working out all day, every day if you're not going to put in the extra work to eat right. Because basically, you cannot out train a bad diet. And that's why eating right is really 80% of losing weight. And the reason why I say this is because it's been plenty of times where I worked out for like an hour, making sure I burn at least a thousand calories, and then I would go home and eat up everything. And literally, I was losing no weight because you cannot I train a bad diet. Like I say, consistently eating right, consistently working out, consistently staying dedicated and pray. This is a very emotional, physical, mental journey. It takes more than just the physical to achieve something like this. You have to be mentally ready, mentally focused and ready to tell yourself that I'm gonna do everything that I can to get this weight off because I wanna be healthier. Not because I'm doing it for somebody else, but because I physically want to be healthy i physically want to look healthier and i want my body to be up and moving up and running you know so i just really want to drop by drop and give y'all some of that motivation because it's not easy you guys and i'm sweating hard because i'm putting in that hard work and i bring that same effort every single day and that's what keeps me going staying motivated keep going stay focused ladies stay focused everyone it's not easy it's very hard but I believe you could do it and like my like i always say if i can do it you can too it just takes the mental the mental state to actually tell yourself yes i can as long as you tell yourself you're tired or you can't do it you won't do it but if you tell yourself yes i can yes i am gonna do it then you will achieve your goal so with that being said i just want to thank you guys for tuning in to this workout and i hope to see you again on my channel make sure you thumbs up and subscribe